Good morning, everybody. Humble George here. Hey, I had a couple of comments come in this morning. Uh, one by Dennis and one by uh, D Max, and I'm going to try to address both of them. But I'm going to tell you right off the bat, I'm not really competent to teach you um, about Sol and Shaders Patch and Pure, but I'm going to do my best. So that's not a disclaimer, but it's so much to cover, and it's how do you go after this some bitch? Uh, but I'm going to do it the best I can. So let's get started. First thing you're going to want to do is you're going to going to have all the Sol uh, 202 if. If you get 202, it's a pay, Patreon paid deal, but it's well worth every penny. Um, I know I'm not crazy about having shit dragged out of my account every month either, but sometimes you do what you got to do. You're going to have these PDFs, okay? Well, I'm going to save you the trouble of, of having to do that. I've taken the PDFs from the Salt and the PDFs from the Pure. I put them in a... Uh, one folder i've compressed the folder and i'm going to have this for you on mediafire you get it all for free how's that now i'm not giving you the programs but i'm giving you the pdfs on how to how to get them going you got to get the programs on your own now what do the programs look like well here's the first of all there's going to be an uninstall older version of saw so that's something you're going to want all right before we even get to this part let's go over to a subtle corsa Settings, a subtle course, apps. Now, you can see what you've got enabled and disabled. Do yourself a favor. Before you uninstall your old stuff and put the new stuff on, just uncheck it. Uncheck everything that has anything to do with Sol and uh, Shader's Patch. Un just get... Just take it off of here. That way there's not going to be a conflict when you put the new shit on and it sees partial shit from the old shit and all of a sudden you end up with a crock of shit. So you don't want that. So um, we do want the shaders extension rain. We want the shaders extension mirrors. Uh, I don't know if we all need the debug. I don't know, really know what the hell it does. But we do want the shaders extension weather. Okay. Now we do want the Sol config. And we do, I don't know if we need Sol Custom Weather, but we're going to slap it in there. We, we do need the planner because that tells us how to plan your weather and get it to come in when you want it to. And now, do we need the Sol Weather app if we're using the Shaders Patch Weather app? That's a good fucking question. And right now, I had it checked, but I'm going to uncheck it. I don't know as I need it, um, but we'll, we, we may. See, I told you I'm not, I'm not capable of teaching you properly. But we're going to, now, Dennis, I'm going to try to, to explain to you how to get your, your wheel not to be going ape shit. Now, Alex ran into this problem, too, and he had a real, I don't know what kind of wheel you got, but he had a top-of-the-line fucking $5,000 wheel or whatever the deal, and it had a special commander. It looked like a little computer that sat on the floor. Remember seeing him in the old days? When he had all that shit, when he had the real cockpit out of a BMW massaged into a fucking racing unit. What a champion. Anyway, I sent him a car. He said, you f don't send me anymore. He just fucked up my whole system. I, it took me half a day to reprogram my wheel. It went ape shit. okay? Well, what we found out eventually was this. No, pod whack. Get, get back there. Where the hell was I? All right, here's the here's little car. What? Follow down here to, to where this is. Now, what is this? You know, click the thing. You can have Gamer, and this is all the goodies you got. Full tank, no pitting. Um, I mean, you'll never run out of gas. Intermediate, Pro, Pro uh, Happy Carts, Pro Humble. Um, just, just hit pro humble. All right, you won't have that, but make it. The deal is this. What does that have in it? Load assist with quick uh, drive presets global. I don't know what that means, so I didn't click it. 
But all the rest of the stuff you see unchecked, please uncheck it. But the most important thing that you want to uncheck is mechanical damage. You don't want any of this bullshit. Not with these cars. You won't get too far. Now, the rest of the stuff is up to you what you want to do. Actually, I like the slipstream because it helps me sneak up. Well, I don't have to sneak. I can go by them like they're going in reverse. But the deal is um, that's, that's it right there. Now, do I want to save this? Sure, why not? Pro Humble uh, underscore plus. Okay, it's just that easy to make it. Then you just save it. Bango. Now, if we went up and looked into the little thing right here, see, it says Pro Humble Plus. So that means if you want to run my cars, run this. You want to run a, a, a Kuno's car, run that. Or so any other car. Just you want the damage on, you want all the happy stuff, do that. Okay? Pro Humble Plus, boom. It's that easy. So you're good to go. Now, right out of there. Heavy thunder. Now, unpack these two things that I gave you. Come up to the saw one and come to install guide PDF. Okay? Right click it or whatever you want to do, just open it. It'll take you from It'll take you from the very beginning of how to even get any of this shit in there. If you start at the top, it gives you chapter. You understand PDFs better than I do. I'm new at this shit. So for me, it, it's, it's just not that easy. But if I go nice and slow, take it like a baby takes his daddy's hand and they walk across the street safe, you're going to want to... Followed a step by fucking step. Now, now, speaking of step by step, look, he's telling you right off the bat, uninstall the older version of Saw, and you want to do it with an, with an uninstall bat. See it? Right here. That's what I was telling you, the uninstall bat. Just run the sound, bitch, and follow what it tells you to do. It's not that tough. If I can do it, you damn sure can do it. So, now, you know enough to never use damage for any of my cars, and you know how to fix that. So we're all set as far as that goes. Um, you know how to install them, and you're going to have to follow the, the follow their directions to the T. And if you want to, that that helps. Let's just go to pure, and uh, what's, well, hang on, hang on. There's pure, pure. It's as easy as that. And it is a hell of a lot brighter. And quite frankly, I think the clouds do look better. Now the headlights are a little freaky. You want to really see freaky? Fuck? Well, we do have exposure. We could. If you come in here, you can fuck with the exposure. But this is another good way to hose the piss out of it. Now, if we come over here to the drop-down arrow, and we go to pure, we go to pure candy, watch what it does to those headlights. I mean, I'm not into it. No offense, but this ain't for me. Okay. Pure, what's this? This looks dandy. All right, if you're happy with it. Let's get the fuck out of here and see what it looks like in the truck. Oh, I'm liking this. And look at the, the tracks from yesterday. They're still here. Where do you see that B-roll from yesterday? Oh my god. I, 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 how I didn't laugh myself into it. This looks fucking sweet. racing up the look at that shit I think this is a great thing to uh, close out the video with this type of a visual here there I just set my wheel to 900 degrees let's get this puppy cranking oh fuck it does hydroplane whoa mammy oh ho ho it's hydroplaning no shit! I can feel it, the wheel! 
Oh, this is... I, you're going to like this shit, guys. You're going to like it. Take your fucking time, please. Uh, without the superlatives, still take your time. Take your time. Take your time. Because they changed the, the way a subtle course of feels the road. I mean, the cars that didn't work so fucking good before are going to be amazingly wonderful. Um, they're not going to hop all over the fucking place like they used to because the subtle course it wasn't designed to have cars a long ways out on a huge track. They were designed for a tiny wee track. Alright, I didn't hit anything stationary this time for a change. Yeah, it's definitely, uh, definitely makes a difference. Now, the B-roll that I'm going to add to this, don't blow that off because there's some really cool shit that you're going to be glad you saw. Now, see how I can adjust? I can take the turbo right off. There's right to the fucking wood. Or, I'm sorry. There's right to the, to the uh, firewall. I have stomping the piss out of it. It's, and it's still breaking tire a little, but not terrible. And it looks to me in the mirrors that we've got uh, haze coming off the, the uh, water. I wondered about that yesterday. I didn't see it in the replay. You wouldn't mind hanging with me just long enough to see in this replay, just to hear it, to find out if you can actually see it in, in the recorded video. Because I'm getting the bells and the whistler too that I like. I like that. I'm getting, yeah, it's a, it is, as I say, adjustable. Now this shit on the on the uh, camera lens, I'm gonna look into getting rid of that. I think. I mean, it's cool in a way, but it, it could be annoying also. How fast are we going? And what's nice though, whatever you use, it puts on the lower part so you get to it quick. That's kind of nice. I'm liking that. Now, I'd say there's nothing wrong with that. That looks perfectly good. So if you if you like what you see right now, just follow the directions. Because that's basically what I did. I followed the directions, believe it or not, for once in my life. Now, I wanted to mention, I wanted to mention it way earlier than this, but I just now thought of it. I watched something this morning, a video, and I put the link to that video, I'm going to put it in the description box. It is... Wow. Yeah, that, I don't like this water on here. I can't see what the fuck's going on. Let me stop this. Here, pause, pause, oh man, pause, pause, pause. Let me talk to you for a second. This video. Alright, camera five. I, I had a funny feeling to watch this for the last, I don't know, a couple times I've seen it. But So this morning I, I clicked onto it right after I went to the comments. And I, I paid close attention. And the guy's telling me, to, telling me clearer than I've ever heard it before the reason why Jesus Christ went to the cross and everything that was accomplished for you and me because of what he did. I'm not ashamed to tell you that. In fact, that's why I'm giving you the, the video link, not to tell you how to live your life. I want to expose you to this information for you to have a chance to make up your own decision. Nobody's forcing you to do anything. It's information. You, you take the information. I got 50 years of reading the Bible. I know what he's telling me is the truth, but I never saw it this clear. Because just like these two programs we're trying to install on your there's a lot to try to take in. It's so hard to get it all in, in one bite. And it's so easy to run off. Oh, look at a shine. It's so easy to run off half-cocked, thinking you know what the fuck you're doing, when there's you're not even close to knowing. But you don't know you don't know because, as Squonky would say, you don't know. So what I'm going to do is, is put this link in there. It's a 22-minute video. Watch it, please. It could, it'll, 
if you get out of it what I got out of it, I am not worried at all about the world, what's going on around me. I'm not worried about the devil. I'm not worried about sickness or disease. I'm not worried about poverty. I'm not worried about a dang thing. I'm psyched. I'm happy. And now I understand why God has taken such amazing care of me. It has nothing to do with me as a person, like, like I'm a pet to God. It has to do with what he wants to do for you, everybody else, get you out of debt, keep you healthy. Everything that, that God has told us about why this world was made, and it's all in 22 minutes, why Jesus went to the cross, why he let the things happen that they happened. And he'll show you, just like you took um, one on one side, the Old Testament and the New Testament, he'll show you exactly where they're fulfilled. From. It's, just in 20, it's just the crystal clearest thing I have seen ever. And I got so much out of it, I couldn't begin to... I got a, head, a light out. Well, anyway. But there's, look how nice this fucking thing looks. But... Guys, I'm going to end the video on a good note, but don't don't hesitate to watch that. And make up your own mind. This is some help to you. Everything that you need is in uh, the description box. It will be in a link from, I'm not giving you the two programs. I can't. You've got to buy them. Or to, I'm, we're robbing the, these people, and look what they did for us. They transformed the subtle course into a pretty decent thing. But if it had stayed like it was, uh, you'd be playing fucking eye racing or something else for damn sure. And Osetto would be long forgotten. But these guys... salamander i just woke him up and gave him a bath he's hauling ass for parts unknown he's a good little shit though let me corral the bugger before there he is well that's a shitty shot isn't it look at that little scratch at all oh he's a good little guy he said i'm going the other way i needed a little exercise look at him go he determined to give me a shitty shot on the phone uh, I'm sorry, guys. I'm wiggling too much. Of course, it's not hard to believe because I found him hauling ass down the road when I was out on the e-bike last September. Look at that rascal go. I gotta make a new... I had to clean his pen. All right, enough monkey business.
Watch your shit, guys. I just had a fucking riot. Have such fun with this dog gone game. Never to handle this good ever. I didn't know it could handle this good. You could literally drive the piss out of it. I hope Alex sees this, but he's going to be a fucking hard Try and nip a cigarette right in half. This isn't real long, but it's got a cool ending. This is a, I'm having a riot. Absolute good time.
350. That thing kicks ass. Watch this shit. than you could imagine. I am having a ball. That's no little bug, the monkey with, trust me. Beautiful little kid, beautiful. What the hell have I got up my sleeve? You don't play with damage, John. guys aren't sick of me putting these videos up all the time, but how could I not share this with you? I was just trying to have a little fun after dinner. I didn't know I was going to do this. More of that for now. 
that banner. Look at the clouds. They look pretty doggone nice. Oh, fuck it. 350. Look, remember how the other ones were going airborne shortly after that? This thing don't go airborne. That thing is awesome. What a sweetheart to have. Slap Pagani wheels on a Volkswagen and watch it go. Holy moly. I think I'll slap some fang headers on the back of that song. That'd be cool. the bastards by going right up in their lane. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.